Yeah. Well, most societies across the world dress up to, for special occasions. And of course, traditionally Aboriginal people never wore a lot of clothing. And so the body became part of that dress up. And different paints and different ochres, different designs are telling us a different story. And it's part of the information, teaching information, passing on information, it's part of the story in, in the actual body painting. In some cases, the body painting is very elaborate and it uh, speaks to the, like the, the tartan, you might say, the, yeah, the tartan of a particular, particular tribe or clan, or it speaks to the particular thing that that young person is learning. Uh, and uh, young men be uh, coming of age programs, for instance, when, when they're, they're painted in particular ways by particular designs, they enter into the knowledge of that design they enter into, yeah, the information they're learning around it. And it's painted on their bodies like a, a way of uh, enforcing that education process. Some people dress in different ways as whether they're putting on a physical address or they're putting a paint on the body it, to say that they, they perform a special role within, within a, a different, different teachings or learning ceremonies. So body painting takes on different, different forms depending on the occasion. But it's much like somebody getting dressed. And I remember once uh, somebody was saying to a group of young men, uh, well, it's a very pagan act, isn't it, to paint your body? And well, we could say it's a very pagan act for people to put tattoos all over themselves. Uh, you know, that's, that's a value it's a value judgment by a particular community at a particular time. For Jungo, the painting of the body was like putting on clothing. It was like putting on a uniform. And those who are in, say, the, the main teachers at, at that uh, particular ceremony, and those who are in charge of the ceremony, uh, uh, would, would, would put on different, different types of paint and so on. So the, the paint was a form of dress for the different officers in charge of that at that particular function.